Let's see what the weather has in store. Jennifer Olsen's at the map for us. Thank you very much, Graham, and a very good evening to you. It's been a windy old start to the first working week of the year. Captured there by one of our weather watchers on the Isle of Col. Now let's have a look at some of the top wind gusts today. We saw 78 miles per hour over Orkney, widely up to 74 miles per hour across northern Scotland. But I'm glad to say the winds are continuing to ease, although we'll still see gales across the northern Isles until tomorrow morning. But for most of us, it's a dry night. And indeed, that leaves us with a largely dry start tomorrow as well. Maybe the odd shower for eastern coastal areas, but certainly on the whole, plenty of dry weather. Now, despite the, the temperatures not looking too bad, a much colder air mass across the country tomorrow, so you'll notice it colder first thing in the morning. But we should see pretty good spells of sunshine, brighter sunny spells certainly coming through the cloud. Good sunny spells for the far north and eventually across the northern Isles, and gales initially here, but they will ease. Always keeping quite a brisk wind for eastern coastal areas, but away from here, lighter winds and uh, plenty of dry weather across the rest of the UK as well. Much more in the way of sunshine south of the border and for Northern Ireland as well. It's been quite a dull day across uh, Wales and England. But again, the temperatures lower and with a cool or fresh air mass, it will feel cooler south of the border as well. Back here in Scotland, we're looking at highs for around about seven, eight, maybe nine Celsius at best, but you'll notice the difference in how it feels. Into tomorrow evening, it's predominantly dry. We should see fairly lengthy, clear spells as we head through the overnight period and a fairly widespread frost developing as well. So high pressure's now established itself. We will on Wednesday see this warm front gradually edging towards us. What that will do is eventually bring milder air and more in the way of cloud like the days we've seen uh, just running up to today. So starts off dry, cold and fairly sunny on Wednesday, but then cloud increasing in the west with the first signs of a wee bit of patchy drizzle into the west coast by the end of the day. That will eventually cross the country to on Wednesday night and highs of around six degrees. That's your forecast, Graeme. It's a great start to the year. Thanks <laughs> very much, Judith. Thank you for